Scooter headlines the Polar Sound Festival in Vasa, Finland. It's freezing outside, but once this German techno trio gets on stage, the hall is sweltering. Scooter is a big hit in the high north. We often play in colder regions. I'd love to perform in the south of France sometime. I don't know why that is. It just seems to go with the music somehow. Finland's not even foreign for us anymore. We've performed here so often, we deserve a Finnish ID. Are you ready to run? It feels just like it did in the 90s. This is the Scooter logo. We take this to every concert. On Scooter's latest and 18th album, Ace, classic techno is mixed with contemporary club sounds. The single Oi is based on the Melbourne bounce style. Don't take life too seriously. Nobody gets out alive anyway. There's no point in always trying to keep something alive and being so retro. We have a huge repertoire of classics, fast pieces and typical scooter techno pieces. You have to at least try to reinvent yourself from time to time and redo the whole thing so it's in keeping with the times. Transformieren, dass es in die Neuzeit passt. Nein, nein, nein. The driving force behind the new sound is 25-year-old Phil Speiser, a DJ and producer from Austria. He joined the long-standing team in 2014. Sometimes they have an odd way of saying things. There are lots of things that have no words for them, especially in music production. But there are terms these guys toss around as naturally as if they were in the dictionary that describe a particular sound or something. Hyper, hyper! Scooter buzzed the charts in 1994 with its first hit, Hyper, Hyper. It's so beautiful to see your hands in the air. Since then, the group's had nearly 40 singles in the international charts. Scooter is both loved and hated, but its recipe for success has worked right to the present day. Fast beats, well-known melodies, and a belting voice. Sometimes it makes me laugh when people seriously philosophize over lyrics. I think, what a load of nonsense. Our song, Oi, for instance, goes, everywhere I go, all the ladies want to touch me. Of course, that's part wishful thinking and part self-ridicule. Und, uh, the musicians meet fans backstage. After 30 million album sales in 23 years, Scooter tries to stay close to its fans. We're proud of our fans who have been with us for years, and new ones keep showing up. That continues to the present day. <laughs> With a new album in the bag, Scooter will soon be zipping back to Germany and off to tour Britain and Russia.